Welcome to the Roy Snar Show, entrepreneurship and giving back. Now, here's your host, Roy Snar. And you're right. And, and, what, and what I love about what you just said is that Roy's cried. I've cried. Yeah. God knows I've broken a wine glass or two just from frustration. And, and I remember four and a half years ago, I came up with this quote. And people loved it. They're like, wow, it's powerful. It says, you're not a true entrepreneur until you're in the bathroom crying and you're 99.9% sure you're going to give up. Yeah. You're going to quit. But you don't. Wow. Yeah, that's powerful. I remember driving in a 95 Dodge diesel truck. I love that thing, dude. It was, we called it the dragon. It was so loud. Driving to LA because I was trying to make this insurance business work. And I was listening to a tape by Ed Milet. And it was called The Eye Opener. I don't think you can get it anymore. It was back in the day when he was just becoming popular. And I was crying listening to it because I was so pissed off. Like, why is everybody else like having this massive success? I'm like, just like stupid. I'm a slow learner, I guess. But I remember just sitting there crying so mad listening to that CD. Like, I'm going to make this work. But yeah, there was multiple times throughout a series of years that I wanted to quit. Right. Yeah. But I kept getting called back into it for a reason. I just said, okay, I got to stick with it. If I just stick with it, I know it'll work. It may take me longer than somebody else, but that's okay. I know it'll work. <laughs> and that's, 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 man, you're just touching my heart because so many of us, we want that instant gratification. Oh, yeah. And you got to take to heart the words that Roy just said because we listen, it's over years, over time, yeah. consistency. And many of you are not succeeding the way you want to because you don't have the right character. Something I talk about in my book is if you don't have a million dollar character, a millionaire's character, you're not going to make it. You can't be, you can't be a five figure person and expect to have a million dollar business. You mm, can't be a good. five figure husband or wife and have a million dollar home. It's not sustainable. Right? No, you're right. You're going to self implode. You're going to self destruct and you're going to self sabotage. And I've seen it over. Many of the clients that I coach, wow. that's what they go through because, right, they have this million dollar business, they have this million dollar home, but they have a thousand dollar character and they have a thousand dollar marriage. Wow. And then they wonder why they're having affairs, why they're hooked on cocaine, why they're taking drugs, why they're turning to alcohol. Yeah. I get it. I mean, I understand sometimes the light's so bright, it happens so quick, but yeah. they don't have the right character. And this is the second thing is, where are you not maturing at? Yeah. Wow. You got to mature. Yeah, no, and that's hard too because then again, you're breaking the comfort layers, you yeah. know. And so, with all your knowledge, what do you what do you do to give back to the community? Uh, do you have a, a course, a free little course for people? You give out a book. What, what do you do to give back to the local community and nationwide? So we have a nonprofit called the Mahdi Strong Foundation. So my wife, being a breast cancer survivor, mm -hmm. we give back thousands to our community there in San Antonio, Bay County. Oh, so interesting. When we were going through this journey, yeah, um, just. You still need help. People don't realize that when you're going through chemo, you're going through radiation. Yeah. Aside from insurance, right? Well, aside from you paying insurance and everything else, we were still spending about a thousand, and it was like a thousand dollars a week in expenses for for my wife's wow. breast cancer journey. And people would help you, but okay, we got to wait ninety days. I'm like, well, sheesh, ninety days. It's, that's not. I need. I need to help now. <laughs> yeah. So what we do with the Mari Strong Foundation, that's um, Mari M A R I Mari Strong Foundation, is we help women and some men right majority of breast cancer is women but there is men out there we give them right we help them with their co-payments on chemo on um mm -hmm. if they need groceries right we'll give them a hundred dollar gift card to heb or wow. we, like right we really fill the gap because those are the right to people that that are going through this journey just helping them with their light bill two hundred dollars i mean yeah so we're able to help a lot of people in a broader spectrum instead of just like we'll wait 90 days no like we look at it assess it hey you know what? We've been there because, right, going by, going down that path. Yeah. Filling up somebody's tank of gas, you're like, man. I mean, people just cry and are grateful. So, with wow. the Mighty Strong Foundation, we've been, we've been these past four years, we've been able to give back thousands every year. It's Mighty Strong. Mighty, Mighty, M A R I. M A R I. Mighty. Yeah, Mighty. Oh, okay, Mighty oh, Strong, Mighty. Mighty okay. Strong Got Foundation. It. Got it. And then every 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 October, we have a women's conference called Finding oh. Your Inner Beauty, because my wife had a double mastectomy and. There was a period where she didn't have her breasts and she didn't feel beautiful. Wow. So God just put it in our hearts. Find your inner beauty. Look inside for your inner beauty. So every October for Breast Cancer Awareness Month, we have a, a conference that we bring in speakers. And a lot of the money that we raise, a big part of it goes back to women that have breast cancer. 
Wow. So we're able to really give back and pour into the community. And you can go to our website, uh, Mari Strong Foundation. That's M-A-R-I strongfoundation.com. And you can find us there. And, and it's just, there's nothing like helping people because yeah. we all need help. We're all going to need help at some point in our lives. Right. And it's the whole thing of giving. Like uh, we have another guest on the show. And it's like, if you give to people, don't expect anything in return. That's the best type of giving. Right, mm -hmm. that's, that's true fulfillment, in my opinion. Like you'd be able to donate and help out. You may not see the direct dollar where it helps this family out, but knowing that you're helping these families out, that's super yeah. rewarding. So that's really cool. That so that's what your idea. You're giving back through this charitable foundation, some of the profits of your companies, and making big impacts on their lives. That's that's amazing. Yeah, like this this one lady came and just this was just actually last month, and it, it was it was it was she didn't ask for a certain amount, but just in the wisdom, right? Asking God, well, what do we do? Mm -hmm. And and we gave her a pretty good chunk, but it felt so good. Yeah. Wow. It, it felt so like, because sometimes people are in this, there's, listen, ladies and gentlemen, there's still good people out there that really need help. They just need a chance. Yeah. At some time in your life, you needed a chance. Wow. And maybe someone good. gave you a chance and you forgot about it. Yeah, give it back. And she came and I just told my wife, just pray about it, What, see what God puts in your heart. And because uh, the, the average donation that we give back to people is around 500, it was way above that. Wow. But I share that with you because being a millionaire allows you to do that. Yeah. See, money is just a tool, right? People have you know, Does that perception. make sense? Like, 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 like how can you make any, how can you help anybody if you don't have any money? If you're broke, yeah. you can't help anybody, right? So that's a, that's a great way to think about it. And then people make the misconception, oh, well, Money's not important. They say they don't yeah. even they don't even realize. Oh, money's not important. I'm, I'm, love is important and kindness. Well, yeah, but we'll go to the bank. <laughs> yeah, go to the bank downstairs right here in this amazing <laughs> building we're at, and go pay your car payment with love. Yeah, they're gonna say like, get exactly. the hell out of here. You're just, yeah. what are you? You're crazy. Right. But that's the way people's perspective. I is. know exactly, exactly. So with our foundation, we've been able to help just give hope to women, and it's just, it's been beautiful. So that's awesome. I just I just. I love giving back. And another thing that we do too is we have our show that you're going to be on is the Daniel yeah. Gomez Inspire Show. We have some top amazing just guests. Roy's going to be on here soon. And we really add value and in, in inspiration and in business and entrepreneurship. So we give you a lot of free content that, I mean, you know, it's, I guess I get in a free coaching session that you're getting because yeah, wow. if you listen to it more, I always tell everybody, get out your pen and paper because what you write down, you remember. Yeah. So with the Daniel Gomez Inspire Show, we really pour in value to our audience and you know, I truly believe that I wouldn't be where I'm at without God. Yeah. So a lot of times people are embarrassed to talk about God in their business. But for me, the moment I made yeah. God my CEO, God, then That's my awesome. family and then business, we doubled in 2021. We doubled in 2022. Right wow. now, we just finished uh, the month of, uh, of May and our records were just like, wow. I was just like, I was in tears. I was. That's so amazing. Because I made God my CEO. Yeah. I Gratitude. Think, yes. You know? That's awesome. So tune into the Daniel Gomez Inspire show here soon too. That's, that's another way we give back and just add value. And so what's the, what's the easiest way for people to find you? And then what's one tip you can leave everybody with today that can help make a big impact? Yeah. Just one. I know it's hard because no, 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 there's no, so no, many. No. So, so, so the thing is this is uh, send me an email at daniel at danielgomezspeaker.com. That's daniel at danielgomezspeaker.com. I'll give you a complimentary discovery session and maybe I can wow. ask you a question or give you a breakthrough. But I love to pour into your community, Roy, and give them that to Daniel nice. at DanielGomezSpeaker.com. And I'll give you that complimentary discovery session. Just put Roy Schnarr Show and I'll, give, I'll send out the link and we'll set that up. And, and the last thing I want to say is this, is that when you realize that you're more valuable than you thought you were, when you realize there's nothing that you can't do, you really start living. Wow. And for me, the breakthrough came as this is, when you realize you got to stop caring about what people say or think, yeah, that's where true freedom comes. Because we say it, I don't care what people think, but deep down inside we do. Give yourself permission to stop listening and embodying the identities and the labels that people put on you. Well, thank you so much, Daniel. We really appreciate you having you yeah. on today. And think about the COI, right? This, and if you're an insurance nerd like me, it's not the cost of insurance, it's the cost of inaction. Daniel has graciously but you email him, you get a discovery session with an award-winning business coach. This is amazing. Take advantage of that. Buy a copy of his book. It's on Amazon. Read that. Implement it into your lifestyle. And the biggest thing is just take action. Do something, okay? Thank you so much. We we'll look forward to seeing you next time.